Hello you guys and welcome back. I have an entire roundup of fall pieces from Walmart to share with you guys in today's video. And it's been a little bit since I've shared some Walmart finds. So I'm really excited to uh, be sharing some new arrivals with you guys today because you all seem to really, really like the last time that I shared some Walmart pieces. So I hope you guys are excited. And as always, I'll have everything linked down below in the description for easy shopping. But let's go ahead and just jump right on in because I have a ton of pieces to share starting with this one I keep calling this a shacket that's just what it feels like to me uh, but this is a really comfy piece I thought it looked so cute and I'm really happy that I snagged this it has like an acid wash to it and so it looks more like a faded green instead of a solid green which I really like I think that's cute and just I don't know feels very fallish to me I don't even know if fallish is a word but that's how it feels it feels very fall-esque very seasonal um i'm wearing a size small and i really like the fit of it i like where it hits um and i like how i do have room underneath if i wanted to pair this with some long sleeves and some more layers like i definitely have room to do that but for now for some transitional outfits i think it's really cute paired with this little white set and some sneakers gives it more of a casual athleisure feel uh, which i live in outfits like these and especially this time of year where it's still very much uh warm out where i live um, but having a little layer is nice sometimes so i think this is the cutest thing and it's actually really comfy it's pretty soft it is lightweight too making it perfect for transition weather i like the collar that it has and the buttons do go all the way up to the front oversized pockets on the front as well and yeah if you can't tell there's some rib detailing on it too but this was $28 it was $27.98 I thought that was such a good steal it comes in a few colors I also picked it up in blue so I'll show you that in just a second here is the back though really quickly it's just plain there's no detailing or anything um, all of the detailing is in the front, but this is such a comfy, affordable little find. Here is the blue color, which I equally love. I think it's so cute. They both still have the tags on them because I had made a promise to myself if I got both colors that I would keep one and return one depending on what I liked most. Uh, but I really like both of them. So I think I may just keep both of them. It's gonna be hard. Let me know if you guys have a favorite down below in the comments, but I think the blue is really cute. I love the color. I love the acid wash on this too. I think it's really fun. It just kind of looks like worn in, feels very seasonal. And um, I think this will be just a super easy layering piece as well. It honestly works super cute with the um, matching set and sneakers that I had on. I love pairing it with a hat for even more of like a casual athleisure feel but i got the same size this is a small and yeah i just think this is so cute i could also envision this being really cute with like leggings and a t-shirt maybe boots but sneakers uggs like all the things i i obviously need to share a lot more ideas with you guys there's one thing that i'm very into that i hope to share more of on this channel but i love styling one piece multiple ways so anyways <laughs> This is one of those that I feel like could be really versatile for me and I think I will get a lot of views out of, but again, $28 and I love the green and I love the blue. Next up is a really simple piece, but this is a staple and it can be worn year round and it's just a really good basic to have. I think in your closet. Um, so I'd been on the hunt for just a blue and white striped dress shirt or button down. I have another one, but it is a linen material. I really wanted something that was dress shirt material, had that structure to it and was a bit more oversized. So I found this one at Walmart for $15.98. So literally two cents under $16. And I decided to pick it up and I love the fit of it. I love the coloring of it too. It's a white shirt, blue skinny stripes. I think it looks really chic, really cute. Um, I love having shirts like these for layering. Um, I love putting them over athleisure wear and athleisure looks. I think they're really cute. But um, from some of the trends and fall looks that I've seen on Pinterest and such, I have a lot of ideas for how I would wear this a little bit more formally, like with my trousers, maybe with black denim, things like that. So I wanted to have it in my closet as an option so I can play around with it a bit, try to style it a few different ways. Um, and I just know I'll grab for this a lot. So I think I mentioned it, but I got a size medium in this. I really like the fit. It's like 
perfectly oversized what I envisioned. So I'm happy with this choice um, in sizing that I did. It's hard to see because of my hair, but it does have a little collar up here at the top. The buttons go all the way to the top. Um, the sleeves are the only thing that are a little bit long, so I prefer them rolled and to have a cuff anyway. I think it just looks more casual than leaving the dress sleeve full length with the button um, and such showing. So that's not a problem for me. And then the back is just plain. It's oversized, not really any detail to it, but I just have this paired with a little onesie from Amazon and then my belt bag, which is also from Amazon and sneakers. And this is like an ideal summer to fall transition outfit for me for running errands, grabbing a coffee, going to Target, anything like that. This next one is one of my favorite pieces in the entire haul and I'm so happy that I picked it up because I really was on the fence and quite frankly, the photos on their website just do not do this piece justice at all. They just don't capture the quality of this. They don't capture the details and like the material that this is. Um, and it's really nice actually, and I just think it's beautiful. So I'm super happy that I got this. Uh, it's the blazer, if you couldn't tell what I'm talking about, and I love everything about it. It's under 50. I love the style of it, the fit of it, the pattern, the material, literally all of it. Um, and I'm not gonna lie, it almost looks a little cheap on the website, like in the photos, but I have it on obviously, and I have it here in person and it just is actually a really nice blazer. So I was pleasantly surprised cause I took a risk, but I thought for sure I would be returning this and I'm not at all, I'm absolutely keeping it. And it's one of my favorite blazers. Um, the color pattern, if you can't tell, it has a little bit of gold in it and then it has light blue as well. And I love this color combo. It's so subtle and it's so pretty. Um, and again, the pictures on the website definitely don't capture um, the colors. Like it really enhances the yellow on the website. So I really wasn't sure if I was gonna like this because in my mind, I was thinking if this shows up and this is like a yellow and black plaid blazer, I just don't think I'll be into that. Um, so I was pleasantly surprised when it arrived and I saw the blue in there and I saw that it's really not as yellow as it looks like at all. Um, so love that. Love the single button here on the front. I think it's really cute and I love the collar on this and how long it is, how far down it comes. I think it is stunning, really beautiful. Um, the faux little pockets on the front are nice too. And then the button detailing on the sleeves I think is really cute. There's four buttons. Um, and I like it a lot. It is lined on the inside. It's super nice as well, which again, I just didn't know what to expect, but pleasantly surprised. It's incredibly comfy and I'm really happy with the sizing too. I got an extra small um, and at first when it came in and I started to put it on, I was like, oh, maybe I'll exchange this for a small. But then once it was on, I realized I really like this fit and to be honest, so many of my blazers that I have in my closet are oversized. I really don't have a ton of blazers that fit true to size and um, are a bit more fitted, but I really like it. Um, I like the length, the sleeves are perfect on me. I have plenty of room throughout the body of the blazer um, and the sleeves I will be able to layer. I don't know that I would be able to get this over a sweater or anything, but a light long sleeve top I should have no problems with. Um, but for now, for like a little transition outfit, I have it paired with the onesie. I think it's cute. I know this won't be for everyone, but I love like, sort of edgy athleisure outfits. I think they're cute. So paired it with the onesie. I love the baseball hat and then sneakers. And this is like, I don't know, another cute on the go outfit to me. Next up is a, another one of my favorites and it's not an item of clothing. It's actually an accessory and it's this bag. I was swooning over this as soon as I saw it. I thought it was really, really cute. And I love houndstooth. So this has a little houndstooth print on it. And I loved the shape of it. I loved how structured it looked. And now that I have it in person, I can confirm it is structured. It's actually really nice. It was only $23 too. It was $22.97. Um, so I'm really happy with the quality for the price. And I just love how this looks. I think houndstooth is so cute for fall and winter. I thought this 
this could be a fun little bag um, if we're doing something that's a little bit more businessy, if I'm going to a coffee shop to work, anything like that. I just really don't have a bag like this already, surprisingly. Uh, and I love the look of it. I love the little gold details. I love the black leather trim and the oversized handles in the black leather as well. And I think this will go with a lot. Um, the size of it is perfect too. Uh, I have already tried and I can fit my MacBook in here and then there's still plenty of space for other things too So I really loved that but I figured if you are somebody who is a corporate girly or even if you're going to Class and you want to look a little bit more put together and elevated This could be a cute bag or if you're like me somebody who works from home But from time to time you need like a cute little work bag going to a coffee shop or something like I think this would be perfect I'll just show you guys really quickly. There's a magnetic snap to shut it closed, but there's a ton, ton of room in here. And there's a closer look at the pattern too. I have a few sweaters to share with you guys that I picked up. This being the first one, I think it's so cute. Another little, I guess you could call the town's tooth print. It, I feel like it is, but it isn't because it's disconnected. But um, I do like the print on it. I think it's cute. And the sweater is actually so cozy and soft. So I like that a lot. I love the gray and white too. It felt very cozy to me and the mock neck is nice too i usually prefer a mock neck over a turtleneck because i just think they're more flattering on me um so i do like that a lot and this was under 30 it comes in a few colors i picked it up in two so you will see both uh, but this is the first one the gray and white and i did a size small in this i did a medium in the next one that i'm about to show you i just wanted to see what the difference was but i really like the size small it fits super well it's still a little oversized it's cozy there's room for a front tuck um, but I'll take it out in a second and show you the full length too uh, but it kind of has like a fuzzy little feel and look to it so again I just think that makes it so cozy uh, and I love it paired like this. this is more of a true fall or maybe even winter if you paired it with a coat um, type of outfit which I really like but I have it with some jeans Boston clogs and socks I thought it was a little vibe i think it's cute this is such an easy casual outfit that i feel really good in um and then as far as the full length of the sweater this is it out in a size small on me um i love that there's a band down here a little hem that matches the hem on the sleeve so and the mock neck so it just kind of ties it all in but pretty good length for size small then i wanted to quickly share this jacket it just came in i didn't know if it was going to arrive in time while i was filming but it just got here um i got this in a size small and i think it's really cute i love the style of it and it's super nice quality it's like nice and thick and heavy and i like it a lot um i got a size small i definitely have a little bit of room um but overall i like the fit of it because i will have room to layer heavier sweaters and such underneath and i like the length too i like where it hits me it has um two sets of buttons so it has the buttons that you can button like through these and then there's inside buttons as well which are kind of hidden so i liked that feature i thought it was cute uh but this comes in a few different colors i just really loved the gray i'm going through a gray moment right now i thought it was nice and it does have pockets on the front i liked the sleeve detailing it basically looks like faux wool if that makes sense and it's a peacoat style so i do like this a lot i don't know if i would necessarily style it with this outfit i just wanted since i wasn't really planning on sharing it i figured i would just pop it over and share show you all um but i see this being really cute with some athleisure wear too definitely leggings maybe my faux leather leggings like my spanx ones regular leggings um putting some hoodies underneath of this wearing it with some sneakers or even boots all the things but i like the fit i like the style and i like the structure of this this is the same sweater as before but in tan and i will say this is more of like a cooler tan than like a warm brown so just keep that in mind but i really like the shade i like the color of this a lot i think both this and the gray are really cute and um, I got this one in a medium. It's just a tad bit more oversized and definitely has a super cozy fit to it. Um, it still has the mock neck. Everything else is the same. The material is soft and cozy, has that disconnected 
um, houndstooth print on it, which I think is fun. And that always feels like very wintry to me. So I like that a lot. And I absolutely love it paired with the skirt and boots. I am just, I'm in an era right now, a skirt, boots, sweater era. And I'm not really mad about it because I just love it. And this feels like an easy little pre-fall or even fall, honestly, um, outfit to me. I just love the look of these three paired together. I think they're really cute. I haven't stopped wearing these boots since I've gotten them in, um, but this is what it looks like tucked. I did a little looser bra tuck just for more of a cozy look. And you can see the back I left out and long. I kind of like that with it being so oversized, but if you, but if you are curious about full length, this is what it looks like in a size medium out. There's definitely a lot more space. I think this will be so fun to pair with leggings as well. But yeah, I think this is a good little find and definitely would recommend checking this one out. This next sweater is another favorite out of the whole haul. This sweater is gorgeous. I love the material. I love the color. I love the fit. Um, it's another one of those finds that I was really impressed with the quality when it arrived. I just wasn't really sure what to expect, but it is so soft. It's thick. It's ribbed. It's cozy. I just love it. Um, and I'm really happy with the fit and the size too. I went to a size medium in this. It has a mock neck, which I think is really flattering. I love that the sleeves are a little oversized on me. And then lengthwise, there's still plenty of room to do a tuck in the front, or I'll show you guys the length out. Um, I think it's going to be really cute with leggings and stuff. But yeah, this sweater is immaculate. I'm pretty sure it was under $30. And um, I just love it. I loved that the rib detailing does switch up too on the arm. I think that just adds some extra texture and detail to it, which I really like. And I just love green for fall and winter. It's one of my favorite colors. I just think it's easy to wear. It's easy to style. In my book, it's a neutral. And yeah, I love this. I cannot wait to wear it a bunch of different ways. And lastly, I grabbed these sweatpants and I absolutely love the color of these. Hopefully they show up true their true color on camera, we'll see. But the shade of them is called Espresso. They are like a super dark brown. I feel like they have a little bit of a red undertone to them, almost like a burgundy undertone, but they're definitely a dark, dark brown. I didn't have any sweatpants or joggers in my collection that were this color. So I'm really happy that I was able to snag these. They were definitely giving fall vibes and I live in comfy clothes. So I wanted to add these to the bunch. Um, I got an extra small. These are technically unisex. So keep that in mind for sizing, but I'm definitely happy I went with an extra small. Anything else would have been too big. And I still have like a little bit of room in these, but they are very comfy. I do have them cuffed twice on the bottom. Um, I'm 5'2 for reference. So I think if I was wearing them at home, like I probably wouldn't care if they were their regular like uncuffed length. But if I'm styling these, wearing them out, I definitely would want to make them a little bit shorter. So I like this length a lot. They have pockets and they have a drawstring waist, which I think is really cute. They are definitely high-waisted. Um, they're nice and fleecy on the inside, but they're not too thick, if that makes sense. They're still pretty light and comfy. And then um, here's the back. They're a little tight on my booty, but otherwise they're not super fitted through the leg. Um, they have a little bit of room and material, so they are just like a comfy sweatpant. And this side over here, hopefully you all can see it because I feel like it looks so dark in the camera, but there's a, a little pocket on this side. And for whatever reason, it's only on this side. It's not on the other side too. So I um, thought that detail was pretty cute, but this is just an easy loungewear outfit that I would totally wear around the house or running errands, things like that. I like it paired with the Boston clogs. These are a little Amazon find and I'll have all the outfit details linked down below, but these come in so many different colors. So if you're just looking for an easy to wear, easy to throw on sweatpants, definitely check this one out. Um, they were under $20 too. I think these were like $17 or so. But all right, you guys, that is gonna wrap up and conclude today's video. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing some new pieces from Walmart. Let me know if you wanna see more Walmart hauls um, or any other retailers that you're interested in seeing some try-ons from, but I'm so excited for fall content and to start sharing some more fall outfits with you guys. Thank you so, so much for tuning back in and watching. Love you all so much and until next time. Oh
refreshing. Oh, you be my touching. 